What about you? I don't have a lot of thoughts on feminism. I feel like March. in a lot of things you can have like good and bad, but I feel like just like what I've seen on like TikTok and like social media and stuff has been like mostly bad. So like that's not something I'm going to openly say like, oh, I support that because I don't know much about it either yet. So it's like, I don't know. I don't have a, a thought about it. But what if what I told to you say. that you're actively participating in feminism right now? And how am I doing that? By going to school and pursuing a career. Oh, shit. So what am I supposed to do not do that? Well, I mean, look. Like, am I supposed to just, like, sit at home and, like, yes. just, like, rot and just, like, no, no, no. open my legs for my man and cook for my man and yeah, just cook. get my... I'm not, like, I don't know. <laughs> like I, that's, <laughs> that's why I said to a certain extent, that's why, like, I like it. Like, I feel like, you know, like, why not feel empowered? Like, you know, like, I feel like if you want to be empowered, that's not hurting anybody else. Yeah. But when it gets to the point where it's hurting other people, that's when I draw the line. For sure. So let me ask you this then. Do you think um, do you think prioritizing sc school and career is more important than prioritizing a family? Right now, because I don't have a boyfriend and I'm not like on exactly that path. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not going to just like sit and wait. I'm going to like handle myself first. I'm going to do what I need to do from like to build myself Go, queen. for my man in the okay. future. You, you said for I mean? your like, man. No, I, I completely understand. You said for your man. Do you think your man care, your future man, your future dream man, do you think he's going to be interested in your ability to earn money and uh, have a career? It's not even about money. It's about building your just a foundation. Like, going to college, I feel like that's important just to for, widen well, what you Well, you said you for need. your man. Yeah. Do you think it's important for him is my question. Not for you, but do you think for the man that you eventually want to get with, do you think it weighs that much? I don't know. Gotcha, bitch! <laughs> Probably I don't know. know. Like, I'm just, like, <laughs> sitting here, like, active. I, I really don't know. Like, I, don't I know. don't have an answer for that question. Yeah. I really don't. Because you framed it in for your man, and I'm asking, like, do you really think that that's for him? I think on, it really just depends on the man, too. Like, Goodbye, I, queen. I don't know. Like, you put well, me in you a said tough you came position. from a Christian household, right, where mm -hmm. the man's supposed to be the head. So, if the man is supposed to be the head, would it really... Like, would he really care or think it's significant if the woman had the ability to earn too? Would it matter to someone who has this Christian mindset? Probably not as much. Like, men don't Bruh. want to debt like somebody that's not doing anything, like I said earlier. Like, they don't want someone that's like laying around the house, but they want somebody that has foundation. And that's what I'm trying to build right now, essentially, is what I'm trying to like say. But do you have to build it through education? Could you not build that foundation in other means? In terms of what, though? What am, what am I supposed to do? Kids, food. Household. Okay, but what about I, I'm, if I'm she not gets divorced right and now. she wants to have like a career or something? She's not just make it for his man. He's a human. Like okay. I don't live my life so the, for a man. So the but assumption that's of divorce, right? Let's have fun with this. How many times has a guy broken up with you? Maybe like two. You times. triggered two my times? trap card. What about you? Maybe like two times, three times. What about you? One time. One time. What about you? Once. Once. What about you? Once. What about you? It was mutual. <laughs> okay. Uh, someone always initiates a breakup, but that's fine. Uh, for doesn't matter for the purpose of this exercise. Now, how many men have you broken up with? And uh, body counts. No, I'm joking. <laughs> okay. She what about you? How many men have you broken up with? Three. One. That's cat, bro. On my life. Or let me say this: How many men have you rejected? How about that? That's probably a better. No way. Or body counts. I don't know. A bunch, right? What about you? <laughs> I don't know. My How many dad. men have you rejected? A lot of people. A lot. Same. <laughs> so, because you, and the reason why I said this is because you gave the idea of, hey, what if the man leaves her, right? But. No, leaves her. What about if the relationship doesn't work and she wants to be a human? She likes to be an integral woman and she has a career. The, my purpose of doing that whole experiment is that men don't really reject women. Women reject men. Okay, but what about if I am your wife and um, the, the relationship doesn't work and we have to break up? Even if I break up with you, the I'm not happy with you. Like, so, I want to break up with you. You know, but here, here's the thing. Men don't break up relationships that are good. Like, we just don't. Like, it's the women that break up the relationships. Why we break up relationships? No, because the relationship doesn't work? Because I'm not happy? Because you're oh, making... There you things? go. You just said it right there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just said right there. I am not happy. So, here's a problem. Like, we have this idea 
in America and in the West in general where women think that they need to be happy at all times in their no. relationship or their marriage. And that's really not what marriage was about. It's about like duty. Like we have a family together. You piss me off. I piss you off. But we're going to make this work. Right. But women have such a priority on being happy and, you know, having this dream that they're willing to say, you know what? I can do better. And they go find another guy. Because it's just the women. That. He just make an example right now, like an hour ago, about like he has, for example, a wife. He wasn't happy with her and she has he has a sneaky leak. I never said that. Well, your video, your video shows <laughs> that. Yeah, but, but for example, what skip. about if the if the wife is just sick about situation and she wants to? But that's the po that's so. Here, up. look, I'm really glad that you mentioned that. So this is a difference between men and women, right? We will have a sneaky link, but we will always go back to our wife. You understand? You but for you, if you have a sneaky you. link, you will probably leave your husband at some point. You do Does that make sense? Emotions. So like. Like men, we're able to compartmentalize. Like she's for, this is my wife. She's for, this is my wife. Women, you guys can't do that. It's I'm having sex with him, so I'm gonna start emotionally investing in him. I'm gonna stop fucking my husband. Then you quickly. Question then you okay, for wait, the wait, ladies. But wait, but the, At what age do you think your value starts depreciating and/or is gone? That's a good question. We'll ask that one. Um, what are you saying? Doesn't matter. In the in the example, I'm not with a sneaky link. You are, and yes. I'm find out, and yeah. I'm just not happy with you. I will not go out to find out another one, because it's not about this. How, as you said, we are more emotional. Is I need to feel something for someone else to have sex. So I just want to break up with you, and I would like to have a life, a career, integrity. Yeah, but that's so. but that's my point. Women are more likely to break up because you you said what if. You, the man leaves you, and I'm I'm saying men don't leave women rarely. I don't say leave you. I say divorce. Like men just rarely get okay. Split. In America, women initiate eighty percent of divorces. Eighty men in, in America. In America, eighty percent are initiated by women. Men almost never because leave their wives. Because men has a sneaky links, for example. That's actually not the reason why. <laughs> It's for money. But the point I'm trying to make is, no, is that because you gave the example, oh, well, she should get her career and everything else because her man might divorce her. I'm saying, statistically speaking, that's very rare. It's hard. She'll divorce him before he divorces her. So, uh, uh, Chris, go ahead and ask your question. Uh, so, does your man pay child support for your kid? My man? Yeah, well. Yeah. yeah. He's right now. He, we share the custody. He, he's, he's not even child support. I, I, I don't like. I don't put child support. He just pay things. It's okay. like a mutual conversation and just. Yeah, they still live in the, in the same house. No, he lives in Miramar. I live here in Brickell. Oh, Miramar. Wait. Oh, Brickell. Yeah, he's today Miramar. with his kid because I'm here. Oh, he got money. Oh, That's so... why I told you that he was with. Wait a minute. Kid. I thought you live. She said they're separated. separated. Remember? Yeah, she yeah, said but... they're separated. Wait, but no, uh, we don't uh, yeah. live together. I okay. live in Brickell. Shit, that's even better for you. <laughs> All right, this guy, man. <laughs> Shout out to Brickell, man. That's oh, great. Hey, oh, look, uh, hey, I'm also, I'm not monogamous, so yeah, uh, there you go. I think um, it doesn't work. I think monogamy for men is a lie. But right. uh, they've been waiting, Castle Club. Oh for... yeah, let's go ahead.